Well, they're not alive, but they talk and they move. One even gives birth. A high-tech nursing program at Samuel Merritt University has students practicing on life like mannequins. Jody Hernandez has the story of how they're raising the bar on real world experience. Oh, you feel better. Yeah. She looks pretty uncomfortable. Oh. Your sister's pretty sick. And... It looks every bit like a real medical emergency. But while these nurses are using real equipment, administering aid to a patient who's talking and breathing. I'm like a milkshake. I'm feeling so You know what, my dear, I know that you want to eat, but right now it's probably not a great time. A real life isn't on the line. They are what's called human patient simulators. Samuel Merritt University in Oakland is on the cutting edge of simulation-based education using human-like mannequins to train students and professionals how to save lives. They have the capacity to breathe, to speak, uh, they have, um, we can generate heart tones, peripheral pulses. You the school has six of the high-tech mannequins. They have children, they have newborn babies, they even have Noelle, a pregnant mother who actually gives birth. It's not um, learning by doing on a patient, it's learning by doing on a, on a simulator and then going in and taking care of your, of your patient. Teachers operate the mannequin and oversee the exercise from an adjacent control room. This is real-time actions and consequences. In this training session, nurses from Alta Bates practice treating a patient suffering from sepsis, an infection that kills nearly one million patients every year. If you do what's suggested, um, you save a lot of lives. And the mannequin just rocks. I mean, she talks to you, she breathes, you know, some of them even bleed. It's, it's amazing, the technology. Thanks to the lifelike patient, the nurses feel more prepared to identify and treat a condition that's on the rise. In Oakland, Jody Hernandez, NBC Bay Area News. Well, the school's simulation program has been so successful, they're doubling the size of the operation, opening a new wing filled with the simulation stations.